In our, Bi in our Bibles to the Gospel of Luke, chapter 24. Luke, chapter 24. Tonight we want to finish up looking at the Great Commission according to Luke. So let's read beginning in verse 46. And he said unto them, Thus it is written, and thus it behooved Christ to suffer and to rise from the dead the third day, and that repentance and remission of sins should be preached in his name among all nations, beginning at Jerusalem. And ye are witnesses of these things. And behold, I send the promise of my Father upon you, but tarry ye in the city of Jerusalem until ye be endued with power from on high. Let's pray. Our Father, we thank you for your word. We thank you, Father, for this portion of scripture. We pray that you would teach us from it. And we ask this now in Jesus' name. Amen. So far in Luke's version of the Great Commission, he has been emphasizing the content of the message that is to be preached. Different, uh, this is unique to Luke. In verse 46, the content was to include the death and resurrection of Christ. That's not mentioned in any of the other gospel accounts of the Great Commission, surprisingly. Uh, the, the heart of the gospel is only mentioned in Luke. And also, another part of the content of the message, not just the death and resurrection, but in verse 47, Luke emphasizes that repentance and forgiveness of...